Guy here, and this is Lizard Cow Barns by Mr. Hector on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on Rock Crawl for this test and demonstration of four cow barns. 48.66 megabytes to download, 16 and 18 slots each. Let's find them first in under animals and cows. And here we are. We have two cow barns, one... Uh, basic cow barn I guess you could call it and one with the feeding robot so 484,000 for 200 cows seems excessive to me $688,000 for uh, 200 cows with a feeding robot then we have the cow barn large with 300 cow capacity and then uh, the 796 thousand dollars for a 300 cow capacity with a feeding robot now um let's go through this one quickly first i couldn't find a light switch anywhere and i don't see any lights inside that i can see so food goes here tmr hay or uh, what what uh, tmr hay or grass i do believe let's look at our cows yes tmr hay or grass uh, will feed all of them uh, this one the food goes here you can put loose straw here or you can put bales of straw here where this little bale is milk output well where this little milk thingy is there's a door everything in here you can pick up um so slot counts pretty low compared considering um, I don't think that slot counts right I think I looked at it and it was more than that but um, the animal trigger is let's get our help window on maybe that might help it's been a long day um, 200 cows right Holstein's uh, outside corral and there's an inner now these this is a door open the gate it disappears uh, kind of weird freaked me out at first uh, these do the same thing they kind of like poof just like poof and it's gone uh, slurry here so I have put a um, manure silo on each one of these because I don't think there's manure capacity and no I don't see a manure capacity now for the one with the robots, everything is identical. Even the uh, magically disappearing doors, which still freaking me out. And uh, bam, 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 ba bam, bam, bam. Uh, the robot area here, capacities, hay is 105,000 liters, silage is 288,000 liters, straw 122,000 liters and mineral feed is 50,000 liters. The straw, we have two straw capacities. One's for the manure and one is for the uh, feeding robot. Now, if we take a look back at our cows, it's not gonna show the feeding robot capacities. It's the food so zero because I have not put any food in there yet. And on the hour, in about uh, 28 minutes game time, uh, this little robot will fill up and it'll go feed the cows. So we're going to see if that thing feeds the cows enough to keep them alive, or at least happy. And the next two are identical, except they hold 300 cows each instead of the 200. Oh, yes. Uh, and if we go into animals and cows and look at them, they all have, if we can... Oh, it's going to be very difficult to see. We can switch. Yeah, you can you can change the color. It's just um, yeah. Try and try and see the color on the sides to change them. As you can see there. Um, yeah. Anyways, there's several colors you can pick from. Good luck trying to see which color you picked. Right. Um, so we're going to run time uh, forward and we're going to see what all transpires and then we're going to also i will show you the uh, bale trigger here that to put straw in 
and we're going to test all the milk and slurry triggers and make sure they uh, catch manure and we'll see so we'll see you in a bit Alrighty then, here we are. Let's take a look up here. Food, food. Hey, look at that. Um, well, the cow, the 200 cows here where there was no feeding. Oh, hey, look at that. So the no feeding robot, uh, half the food's gone. No problem there. Uh, with the feeding robot, wow, there is plenty of food there and uh, no problems with keeping that full. So I'm impressed. The feeding robot is doing his job fabulously. Now, slurry and milk uh, are, are good. Let's see here. Straw, the, the levels all look the same, but because 300 cows... Food capacity 220 and food capacity 147. So the food capacity is more in the 300 than it is in the 200. Well, that makes sense. Well, smart so far, Mr. Hector. I'm liking it. Uh, milk. And so, yeah, so everything's looking actually really, uh, really good. Let's, uh, let's go for a quick zip around the back, shall we? And make sure we have manure. I guess I could have went... Yes, we have manure there. We have manure there. Manure there. And manure there. So those check out. Excellent. And how's our capacities here in the robot? Yeah, it's down a bit. They're going to need um, more there, but they did not run out. So that's good. Let's check the slurry trigger. Yes, slurry trigger works. And milk trigger works. Excellent. So far, so good. This is looking um, pretty good so far. And yes, slurry. And milk. Oh, little, little Mr. Robot's on his way. Just finished filling up that one. Ha-ha. Uh, slurry, yes. Milk, yes. Slurry, and finally, the last milk trigger. Yes, indeed. So, and it seems to fill pretty quickly. So... Straw for bedding. Straw not for feeding, not for the feeding robots. Here is a bale of straw, and if you put it close to here, as you can see, the straw will disappear and it will go in as bedding. Now, if you want to put loose straw, you can put it here for bedding as well, but loose straw will not work on this trigger. This has to take, this take bales only. Right, what's what's left? What did I forget? Um, oh, food going in. Yes, I will show you on just this one. They all go, they're all the same. Um, they're all, the food goes in the same spot on all of them. None of them are different. There we go, food going in like so very nice now there is one thing it is a drive-through uh, the, the ceiling is very tall on here too so that's really nice um, there's a gate at the back if you want to drive through I have blocked it with my um, manure heap yes that's what it's called I've blocked it with the manure heap but if you don't block it then you could easily drive through so there is that um, and I think that's everything. Um, aside from the price to purchase it, which I'm not uh, thrilled about, but looking at the cows, um, that's the price of the base game 
large and small actually the large uh, the base game one only holds 80 cows so it's even more terrible 80 cows for 700,000 and here we got 200 and 300 for the seven seven hundred thousand dollar mark so compared to the base game this is a steal of a deal actually <laughs> and there you go lizard cow barns by mr hector on farming simulator 22 thank you all for watching and remember it's only a game so till next time bye for now <laughs>